Viscount is the largest organ manufacturer in the world today. We are focused not only on the products that we're making today, but we're constantly, in fact, we have an obsession about how we can improve those products and what we can do to make them better in the future. And that's why our organs are so different from place to place. When you go and you play these instruments, they sound like they were made for the room. So a big part of that is our technology. In the beginning, what we were looking at is we were actually looking at trying to improve sample sound technology. People, when you ask them, well, how is it playing this digital organ, you know, over time? Well, we found out that they would get very bored of playing the digital organ. Well, why would you get bored of playing the digital organ? Because it always sounds the same to me. It always sounds the same. Well, that's not the experience you get at a real pipe organ. That's because physics is involved with a real pipe organ. But that was missing in sampled sounds. That's where we started experimenting with physical modeling technology. Our physics technology, which is what physical modeling is, it answers the question, not only how does a pipe organ sound or a specific pipe rank sound, but how does an organ act? And how does an organ act based on what the user is doing? These are algorithms that are processed in real time by ultra fast processors. And what happens is, is as the organist is playing, um, they will experience significant changes in how that organ is playing based on from a reaction of how they're playing. So for instance, if an organist is sitting there playing on an organ with physics technology and they start to pull other stops, then they're gonna experience dips in air pressure, they're gonna experience slight tuning variation, but it's very, very important that you understand this is not random. Randomization is something that's done in sampled sound organs. The organ is physically reacting to the user faster than the user can think that it happened. It's probably one of the few digital organs that actually sounds better with time. And in a nutshell, that's what we're trying to do here with an open source, physically modeled platform.